Korean leader Kim Jong Un. Kim Jong Un. North Korean leader Kim Jong Un. Welcome to the luxurious world of Kim Jong Un, the infamous enigmatic leader of North Korea. We're about to take you on a rare tour of his extravagant lifestyle and lavish possessions that few have ever witnessed. From his impressive collection of luxury cars and yachts to his private palaces and priceless art collection, get ready to delve into the exclusive world of one of the world's most powerful and mysterious leaders. This is not your ordinary tour, but a one-of-a-kind opportunity to peek behind the curtain of Kim Jong-un's grandeur. Prepare to be spellbound, intrigued, and mesmerized as we unveil the hidden treasures of this fascinating world. Take advantage of this ultimate luxury experience exclusively for those who crave the finer things in life. But let's get to the juicy stuff, the bizarre things he splurges on. Think imported caviar, luxury watches, and even a giant water slide. We're not kidding, this guy knows how to party. Not only does Kim Jong-un have a personal 13-piece band made up entirely of female violinists, because why not? But he's also got a massive collection of over 30 pianos, some of which cost upward of $170,000 each. In 2014 alone, he allegedly imported 36 top-end pianos into the country, which cost a whopping $6,120,000. Looks like he loves the sound of money. But that's not all. Kim Jong-un has multiple palaces spread across the country, each more luxurious than the last. We're talking 1,000-room mansions, private cinemas, and a giant water slide. And let's remember his love for music. According to none other than Dennis Rodman, yes, that Dennis Rodman, Kim Jong-un is a big fan of everything musical. From karaoke to K-pop performances, this guy knows how to jam out. In fact, he even has his own live band that plays for him whenever he wants. Hold on tight, because now we're about to take a peek into the secret world of Kim Jong-un's 17 palaces spread throughout North Korea. Forget about three part-time residences like former U.S. President Donald Trump, Kim takes extravagance to a new level. According to reports, his palaces are nothing short of phenomenal, grand, opulent, and luxurious. Let's start with the Ryan Song Residence, also known as the Central Luxury Mansion. This colossal primary residence covers over four and a half square miles of Pyongyang suburbs, making it about the size of London's Heathrow Airport. The underground wartime headquarters here is protected by iron rods and concrete covered with lead, just in case of nuclear war. But that's not all. The property also boasts a private train station, a horse racing track, and even three artificial lakes. Dennis Rodman, the ex-basketball player and friend of Kim Jong-un, compared the residence to Ibiza, saying it's like a whole city on its own. And with banquet halls by the lakefront, a massive swimming pool with a water slide, a running track, an athletic field, a spa and sauna, horse stables and riding area, and even a shooting range, it's not hard to see why. But wait, there's more. Less than 20 miles of Ryongsong, Kim has another gigantic mansion, the Kangdong Residence. This summer residence is used for holidays and parties with close officials. Just like Ryong Song, it boasts three massive man-made lakes and a private train station. But that's not all. There are furnished entertainment facilities with bowling, shooting, roller skating, horse stables, a racing track, and even a football field. The Supreme Leader has yet another magnificent residence, the Wan Son Residence. Situated on the country's east coast, this property is rumored to be even more lavish and extravagant than previous ones we discussed. The Wonson residence covers a whopping 10 acres of land and boasts an array of private villas, gorgeous beaches, and even a large boat shed that would make any sailor jealous. Moreover, publicly available satellite photos reveal that the Wonson residence is connected to a massive sports stadium and a water park. Can you imagine enjoying these amenities in the comfort of your own home? But that's not all. Kim Jong-un owns 14 other impressive properties that are equally opulent, complete with private cinemas and more. Kim Jong-il also had a strong obsession with movies and cinema, owning a whopping 30,000 VHS and DVDs of Hollywood blockbusters. Talk about a cinema enthusiast. His son, Kim Jong-un, inherited this passion for films and built a jaw-dropping 1,000-seat private theater for himself and his comrades. 
But owning stuff isn't the only way to flaunt your wealth, and Kim Jong-un knows it. That's why he hired the Harlem Globetrotters. This American exhibition basketball team combines athleticism, theater, and comedy in their style of play to play an exhibition game in North Korea. I mean, who wouldn't want to hire them, especially if you have a basketball court in most of your mansions? Did you know Kim Jong-il requested that America send Michael Jordan to North Korea? The Kim family knows how to make the big ask. Unsurprisingly, Kim Jong-un loves basketball so much that he asked the U.S. to send famous basketball players to North Korea as part of a denuclearization deal. And did you know that while the President of America has Air Force One, Kim Jong-un has his own version called Air Force Un. Talk about a play on words. His private jet is the Ilyushin IL-62, a Russian aviation masterpiece with leather couches and crystal ashtrays. With a price tag of $1.5 million, this is one luxurious ride that only carries the dictator and his closest allies. But flying isn't always the preferred method of travel for the Kim family. Kim Jong-il, the former supreme leader and father of Kim Jong-un, had a fear of flying and instead traveled by train. He owned a whopping 90 luxury train cars, including a conference car and several saloons. Kim Jong-un even inherited some of these cars and made some stylish updates, like adding plush pink leather seats to one of them. Unfortunately, Kim Jong-il passed away on a train but his legacy lives on through his son and the train system. There are 20 private train stations across the country that only Kim Jong-un's train can use. With such strict security measures in place, traveling with the Kim family is no joke. He's used his train to visit Russia, China, and even Vietnam, as well as his network of palaces and underground command centers. At this point, Kim Jong-un is not trying to outdo anyone else but himself. And let's be honest, if anyone is trying to compete with him in the extravagance and luxury game, they're in for a tough time. Well, we've talked about Kim Jong-un's planes and trains, but we cannot end this video without discussing his hilarious car collection. The Supreme Leader is seriously obsessed with luxury cars. His collection is worth over $20 million. Can you imagine owning more than 100 cars? And we're not talking about your average sedan or SUV here. Kim Jong-un has some serious supercars in his garages. One of his favorite cars is the Mercedes Maybach limousine, which is bulletproof and costs a whopping $1.6 million. Talk about arriving in style, but that's not all. He also owns a $162,000 Audi R8, a $100,000 Range Rover, and an armored Rolls-Royce Phantom that costs over $500,000. In fact, when he met with Mike Pompeo, the former director of the CIA, he drove a $500,000 Rolls-Royce Phantom. I mean, who needs a motorcade when you have a fleet of luxury cars at your disposal? But wait, there's more. Kim Jong-un also has a love for yachts. And not just any yacht, but a luxurious 95-foot vessel worth $7 million. This beauty, known as the My Princess Yacht, is owned by the Louis Vuitton Moet Hennessy Group. It has three wide decks, a gourmet kitchen, a dining area for up to 10 people, and four in-suite bedrooms. Who needs a hotel when you can sail around in your own luxury yacht? Do you think Kim Jong-un's love for luxury ended with his cars and yachts? Think again. There's another extravagant vessel in the docks, and it's about 100 feet long. But wait, there's more. According to NK News, Kim Jong-un also owns fleets of jet skis, a water slide boat, and a 60-meter-long leisure boat. But the piece de resistance is his private 200-foot-long multi-story pool party barge. Yes, you heard that right. A barge that's the length of an Olympic swimming pool, complete with spiraling water slides and a massive two-story backstage lounge. We've explored just a small fraction of the insanely luxurious life of Kim Jong-un, but none of us can handle any more envy. The man has private planes, luxury trains, a fleet of supercars, and even a freaking pool party barge. Who needs to go on vacation when you can just live on a yacht? It's safe to say that Kim Jong-un is living the life many of us can only dream of. But hey, who knows what other luxurious surprises he has in store for us in the future. Until next time, stay curious and stay luxurious, my friends. And if you want to watch more such videos, click the video mentioned above. You won't regret it.